What we'll do is we're going to keep any fish that we get out of this outlet separate too, so we'll just break the name of the body water on a piece just of paper. Yeah. keep the pond set. Yeah. The northern snakehead is a fish that we got a call about back at the end of May, and immediately following that, we realized that we had a problem. Now, the one that you caught, I saw the photos. Two years ago, I seen a school of fit babies. I thought they was bass or native fish, but there was these things, and I put a few in a fish tank, about this big. A month later, they're double the size, and they ate all the fish in her fish tank, all the guppies, and she ended up flushing them down the toilet. Dad, where'd you put my tank? <laughs> and they're very aggressive, and they'll eat anything in the water that's smaller than them. And they can reach three feet in size. And I mean, if you open up, they have more teeth when you open up the mouth than a, than a pike. They've got to go. We have a chemical that is uh, pesticide that's specific for to fish. We apply that out into the lake in uh, diluted form. That'll be just enough to kill the fish. Then we'll go back through, collect those fish up, bring them back, analyze those fish. Look at that! Something shoot the end of it off. On it. Yeah. And look for any of the northern snakehead fish, and then. Um, compost all those. Fish eradication is something that we use as a last resort. In this case, uh, we believe it's the best method and it's the only sure way of getting rid of northern snakeheads. Well, they get in the smallest spots too, don't they? We're not exactly sure how bad it can get, but we believe that they can uh, increase in numbers at such a rate that we'll see real ramifications both through competition and predation. I'm glad to say I really am to taking care of these things. Just getting in place in five, ten years will be nothing but them. Oh, 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 o